It's been nine years, nine years since we have beat Mississippi State in a weekend series, but thankfully that changed this weekend. The last time Ole Miss won a series against this team, that was back in 2015, but thankfully here in 2024, that changed this weekend. But look, all the years they had Mangum, we never could beat them. The years after he left, Still cannot beat them for some reason, but thankfully that changed this weekend. But Ole Miss won two or three this weekend, uh, lost Friday, and then got the win Saturday and Sunday. But yeah, Friday night, horrible game for Ole Miss. Only got a couple hits all night, just two or three hits, I believe. Uh, not the best pitch from either. Ole Miss got beat eight to nothing. You know, moving to Saturday, uh, Saturday, uh, many lead changes. Uh, the game went into extra innings, went into 12 innings, lasted four plus hours. But thankfully, Ole Miss got the uh, the win there toward the end. But what really motivated our team last night, and this is my opinion, and if you watch the game, you know what I'm talking about. But last night, there was a moment in the game, uh, one of their players, one of Mississippi State players by the name of Johnny Long, had a home run. And when he did, when he had the home run, he did a backflip toward our bench. And for those who don't know, that is an automatic ejection in college baseball. Zero excuses. It don't matter what happened. That is the automatic ejection. And the umpires did not throw him out last night. But when that moment happened, he was not thrown out. Bianco, or Coach Bianco, the Ole Miss coach, came out of the dugout. And you could tell it on TV. You know, he spoke his mind. You could tell he got pretty ugly with the umpire. I don't know what he said, but you could tell he was speaking his mind and got pretty ugly with the umpires. Anyway, long story short, was on the field for about a minute, and then you see the umpires, you know, do that sign, which means you're ejected, you're thrown out. So, yes, Coach Bianco was thrown out last night, but I will say this. Um, and look, I have been very open on some of this stuff the last couple of weeks. Um, even some the last couple of seasons, I have been very disappointed with some of the things that have happened the last couple of weeks, even the last couple of years. I have been pretty open with some stuff. I'm ready, still ready for a change as far as a head coach. I'll be honest with you, that's just my opinion, but still ready for a change. Uh, no matter what, no matter what happens down the road. But I will say this: I appreciate Coach Bianco standing up last night uh, for our team. I appreciate him coming on the field and just speaking his mind. But that moment last night, it pissed off our team. And look, these two teams, they hate each other, cannot stand each other. A bat flip or anything can piss off the other team and get the other team motivated. And I honestly believe that moment last night, shout out to Johnny Wong, but that moment last night, I honestly believe it motivated our team today. Today was it was a new baseball team. It, this is a team we have not seen this year. Uh, today, Ole Miss had 16 hits. Ole Miss had 14 runs, a uh, couple home runs, only one error all night. You know, very good pitching. You know, this is something we have just not seen basically all year, and once again, I, I just don't know what to say, but shout out to Johnny Wong. I appreciate you pissing off our team last night, but anyway, uh, super, super happy. We finally won a baseball series. It's been a minute for sure, uh, but extremely happy beating our in-state rivals for sure. Peeps, that's all I have for the video. Uh, whether he all thoughts and feedback as well, too. If you can, just please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Would be great appreciated. See you guys in this video. Have a good one. And, of course, hotty toddy.